What's up? It's your boy Gator Jewel. Can't be no fool. I'm here with your boy. Shit, 10K crazy, you feel me? You know what I'm saying? One time, I'm choking, you know what I'm saying? Stakes cash. All right. You know what I'm saying? Where is everybody based out of? Where are we at right now? Shit, Echo Heights, you know what I'm saying? The fourth on the east side. All east right. Side, Could you tell me about some of your early beginnings on your music uh, journey? You know what I'm saying? Like, how did you get started? Like, what got you to rapping? Shit. I think about like 10th grade, high school. I was going to like, I was going to Lamar over there, you know what I'm saying? And I always had, I had some homeboys that was rapping type shit, you know what I'm saying? I, I never did rap, I ain't even try to rap, no, none of that. I never rapped before that. So I was like, shit, I was sitting in my room one day and I was watching these niggas rap and I said, shit, let me see what I sound like. So I ain't know how to rap, no, none of that. I ain't know how to do none of that. I ain't had no tools, no, none of that. I just had my TV and my phone. So shit, I found me a little beat. And I had named it, I said, I'm gonna name this whole Trim Flow. So shit, it's, it's crazy because like the way I recorded that bitch shit, I had my phone, you know what I'm saying? I was screen recording, I had wrote that bitch down in my notes. So what I did to make a song, you know what I'm saying? I ain't had no, I ain't had no tools, no, no studio, no, none of that. I ain't called nobody for no studio, no, none of that. So I played the beat off my TV and I put that little voice screen record on and shit, I just wrapped it like that and then shit, I posted it on Instagram, and that hell got like 3,000 views. I ain't expected to get, you know what I'm saying? I ain't expected to get that far, so after that shit, I just kept going after that. Shit, they just start fucking me after that. Shit, 10K crazy for real. It's that 10K shit. <laughs> so is there any, like, uh, you know what I'm saying, certain artists, you know what I'm saying, that you could say that kind of influenced you or uh, your sound or anything? Or are you just, like, 100% authentic, you know what I'm saying? Shit. That nigga Sauce Walker, you know what I'm saying? He really, like, I like the way how he rap on that. He don't rap like nobody else. It's like his own flow. You know what I'm saying? It's really hard to master that flow. Like, I feel like if you can master that flow, like, you really got something for real. But, yeah, he hard. I, you know, he, I fuck with that nigga for real. I like how he, he, he talk that real shit in his music. And I got a song, you know what I'm saying? I got a song, but, you know what I'm saying? That's going to drop soon. You know, I'll be speaking that real shit all the time. You know what I'm saying? You just got to listen. You just got to open your ears. But yeah, like, he really influenced me, you know what I'm saying? Like, TLE Cinco, you know what I'm saying? I fuck with that nigga hard. I fuck with Lil Baby and all them. But yeah, like, the main one, like, Sauce Walker, like, I like his flow. Like, he just, like, just get on that beat and just start walking that beat. Like, he just talk. It ain't no extra, all that loud and shit, you know what I'm saying? He just talk and speak that real shit, you know what I'm saying? For real. So, like, speaking of lyrics, like, I remember you saying that you were doing it off of your phone, basically, yeah. uh, when you first started. Yeah. Um, so how is your, like, songwriting process? Or is, like, is it mostly off the dome or is it half and half? Like, how do you, like, how do you approach it? Uh, well, shit, <laughs> I'm going to put it like this, like... <laughs> I ain't really been going outside, like, when I first started rapping, I was outside, but I went outside, like, that type shit, but, like, so, I, you know what I'm saying, I just, like, come up off some, like, past shit, and I just rap about the past shit, but, like, shit, a nigga start going outside, <laughs> that 10K shit, for real, like, nigga just start going outside, and a whole bunch of shit just start happening, so, shit, I just put that speaking facts and shit, you know, how niggas try to play me and shit, and, they not fuck with me for real type shit, you know what I'm saying? I put that in my music all the time type shit. Don't mind the Mexican music, y'all. Uh, <laughs> my boy just vibing out. Yeah. Uh, so, do you have a story behind one of your most meaningful songs? Speaking of like, you know, you going outside and things that started happening. Shit, well, I got like a song called Endangered Species. And if you play that whole, they'll really tell you like what's been happening, you know what I'm saying? What's going on? What been going on in my life? That's some real shit. I was speaking that real shit. You know what I'm saying? What happened with my family and my pops and my homeboys type shit. You know what I'm saying? Go stream Endangered Species. I'm, I'm going to let you know something on that hoe for real type shit. Yeah, that's that's one of my songs where I was just, you know what I'm saying? I ain't even going to cap. Like, as I'm writing that hoe, like, that hoe low-key made me, you know what I'm saying, shed a little tear because, you you know what I'm saying, you speaking that real shit. You know what I'm saying? I feel like a lot of people can relate to that shit. You know what I'm saying? I ain't had no... I ain't had no pops, you know what I'm saying, to show me the way. And I know there's plenty of other niggas out here that's feeling the same way. So I try to relate to people and their problems as much as I can, you know what I'm saying? So they feel like they they not the only one that's going through that shit, you know what I'm saying? So, yeah. It's true, you know what I'm saying? We do have a higher population out here. Yeah. 
uh, without fathers now. Yeah. Um, speaking of that, like, how do you see uh, the role of music in society, and do you feel it has the power to bring change? You see what I'm saying? Like, mm, I feel like music can bring a lot of change. It just depends on what you say. You know what I'm saying? A lot of music today promote violence. And I ain't even gonna care. You know what I'm saying? I got some songs that promote violence. But you know what I'm saying? It's okay if, if you know what I'm saying? You can switch it up. I switch it up all the time. I speak that real shit. I promote violence, no cap. You know what I'm saying? And it's I got some sad songs where I'm really, you know what I'm saying, down. You know what I'm saying? I, I put the feels on the floor all the time. You know what I'm saying? I, yeah, my feelings, my feelings gonna always be on the flow. You feel me? So it's like, you know what I'm saying? Shit, today, music is just, you know what I'm saying? You know how you got the females rapping. I feel like the females on top of that rap shit, you know what I'm saying? They really the main focus right now. You know what I'm saying? But, yeah, like, you know what I'm saying? They pushing my female artists out. I ain't gonna lie, like, some of that shit be hard. I ain't even gonna care. I ain't gonna be no bitch-ass nigga, but, like, some of the shit they just be saying, you know what I'm saying? It be nonsense. Like, you wouldn't want to rap. You wouldn't run away. Damn, I can't talk. You wouldn't want to raise your daughter like that. You feel me? But, shit, when you got people, when you got people out here that, shit, want to be a slut in the whore, shit, that's what, that's what they go to. You know what I'm saying? That's that's what they think the niggas like. But me personally, you know what I'm saying? I make sure me and all my homeboys won't, won't really, you know what I'm saying, fuck with it like that. You know what I'm saying? We ain't trying to go out here, you know what I'm saying, wife no hoe, wife no slut, no none of that. We just trying to make sure that you can, you know what I'm saying, provide for us because we know we're going to provide for y'all. You know what I'm saying? It's just the the sense if y'all if y'all going to do the same, if y'all going to keep that same energy, you know what I'm saying, like 50-50, you know what I'm saying? Because I know for a fact me and my homeboys going to, you know what I'm saying, going to do that for sure. So, yeah, you feel me? That's some real shit. A lot of people, you know what I'm saying, scared around that type of question. Yeah. Especially when you're talking about female artists. Yeah. So I fuck with the realness. Yeah, I'm going to speak. I'm going I'm to tell you. I'm going to tell you how it is. You feel me? Ain't no... Ain't no beat around the bush, no, none of that, you know what I'm saying? I don't give a fuck. It's straight facts. So, uh, you know what I'm saying? Let me get into this other question. Yeah. What do you enjoy the most about performing live? And do you have any, like, crazy uh, on-stage experiences performing or anything of that nature? Well, I'm going to put it to you like this. I ain't ha- I haven't performed yet, but on October 28th, I'm going to be performing. And I'm going to tell you this. I'm going to show my ass, you feel me? I'm going, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to let y'all know this, that 10K shit for real, you feel me? I'm going to let niggas know that, you know what I'm saying? I'm me. So, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to let y'all know. I'm going to put y'all on me. I'm going to put y'all on my way on how I get down with this music shit because I feel like I'm real different. So, yeah, I'm, I perform on the uh, on the 28th and shit. After that, shit, it's going gonna, it's gonna to go off from there. So who are these folks to your left and right here? You know what I'm saying? Shit. I'm going to tell you about shit. Shit, man, I'm Ty Huncho, man. I've been on this nigga since, like, middle school, you know what I'm saying? So, shit, I just been locked in with him. Shit. At one moment, shit, this nigga, this nigga wanted to quit rap. I said, nah, you got locked back in, you know what I'm saying? We finna cook some more shit up, bro. I ain't no sleep, man. Uh, You know, what would you say that you are, you know what I'm saying? Are you, like, manager, artist, you know? I wouldn't say, like, little manager, like... I don't really like saying manager, but it's my brother, bro. For real, you know what I'm saying? Looking out. I just look out, bro. If I see some shit for he he doing shit I don't like, I'm going to just call him out, bro. You know what I'm saying? Some homeboys don't do that, fool. I ain't going to lie to y'all, bro. That shit kind of sad. So, you know what I'm saying? But shit, you know what I'm saying? What's, who on your, uh, well, that's your left right there. Yeah. My left. Yeah. It's Cash, man. This my boy. I've been knowing this dude since middle school, like, like Huncho said, middle school, this my nigga on some shit. And what he is to me, he like, I don't know, the nigga like a best friend, but we don't say best friend. It's always been buddy on some shit. Because like, it don't matter. It's like, you see him, you see me. You see me, you see him type shit. But I ain't going to cap. This nigga put me on a record. Like, I, I thought I couldn't do it, but I can it's like, I got so many songs in my notes, but I'm just scared to drop because it's like, it's different. But I express myself through that shit and it, it really helped you on some shit type yeah, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like he put me on and I forever thank him for that. And it's like, if this when this nigga blow, 
it's like I'm gonna be right there type shit. Like I like when you say win, you know what I'm saying? Manifesting. Cause it ain't no if, it's a win. Yeah, this yeah, nigga got potential, bro. Yeah. He, he does. It's not no think. He got potential, bro. This nigga be speaking. But yo, like yeah. he said. You know what I'm saying? I, I want to thank everybody, you know what I'm saying, for letting me interview y'all. Yo. And music video is dope as fuck. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, go tap into that one, you know what I'm saying? That bitch going to be fire, you know what I'm saying? Like, me, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to let y'all know something. Like, me, I'm going to be me. My homeboys, they going to be them. They going to make sure I got, you know what I'm saying? They going to make sure they got me, and I'm going to make sure I got them. It's, it's ride or die. All my homeboys, I can literally count on my fingers. We don't do no no new members, no none of that. They been riding with me since sixth grade, all of them. You know what I'm saying? They just been down. You know, you got your day one since, you know what I'm saying? Since through even through the ups and downs, you feel me? They, I know they got me, you know what I'm saying? Vice versa, you know what I'm saying? When you got some, when you got people around you that want to win, you going to win. They know, you know what I'm saying? Like she said, you know, ifs and buts, you, we, uh, we going we gonna to get there. And I, I made a promise to all of them. I said, you know what I'm saying? When I blow, when I get to that point, I got all of them, you feel me? And it ain't no, ain't no none of that where I'm going to take care of them type shit, you know what I'm saying? They going to have their little shit going, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to have my little shit going, but I got them like that, you know what I'm saying? We locked in for real, you know what I'm saying? Big word of 2023 is locked in. You got to be locked in, you know what I'm saying? Half these niggas out here, they, they, ain't, they ain't locked in. They don't put their mind to it for real, like. I feel like if you're going to do something, you might as well go ahead and be good at it. If you ain't good at it, you just doing it because everybody else do. You know what I'm saying? There ain't no point in doing it. And I feel like, shit, I'm from Fort Worth. I feel like half these niggas from Fort Worth, they don't got no sound for real. Like, they all sound the same. They just, you know what I'm saying, just be yapping and just be talking. You know what I'm saying? But me, I'm a, a whole lot of dissing. A whole lot of dissing. Like, like, I'm not, you know what I'm saying? If a nigga, if a, if a rap nigga want to dish, you know what I'm saying, I can take it there. But it's like, that's not what they want because I'm going to win every time. But it's like, I don't even really be caring about that shit, bro. We got the same goal. We trying to blow. Like, ain't, everybody trying to get out. Yeah, everybody trying to get out. We don't really have time for this, you know what I'm saying? But if a nigga want to take it there, we can, you know what I'm saying, type shit. I ain't going to speak on that too much. But, yo, yeah. but I just feel like you just got to have a different sound to it. You know what I'm saying? You can't be just mumbling and just saying the same shit over and over. Sound different. It's okay to be different. You feel me? But, yeah, type shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to just let y'all notice that 10K shit. You know what I'm saying? 10K the best way for real. Type shit. And, uh, another big saying, bro. Another big saying. If you don't got no money on it, you're done, yo. You done, ain't had no nigga. fun, yo. What you mean, man? Get y'all paper up, bro. Word. Y'all be worried about the wrong thing. Like, I'm going to keep my nigga's head on, like, on some real shit. If a nigga talking about he down and stuff, bro, go get you a job. Get up. Go get go get the money, bro. It's out here. You just got to want it, bro. And that's all I got to say. And shit. That is all I gotta and one say. of my songs called Ninja Turtles, you know what I'm saying? It was at one point in time where, you know what I'm saying, one of my homeboys, they got down by the bitch. You know what I'm saying? I had said in the song, all my niggas was sad about a bitch, and I told them, just get you a bag and get well, though. You know what I'm saying? Like, a bitch ain't going to bring no money in. It's 2023. They just not. Go get you a bag, bro. Like 25%. 25%. 15 Yo. 10% versus your 110. Yo. Like, you know what I'm saying? I feel like, I just feel like this generation, it ain't, it ain't nothing to be proud of. Like, you know what I'm saying? You got, they ain't got no morals. You feel me? So. It's kind of hard raising a kid in this generation because it's just odd, you know what I'm saying? It's everywhere. You know what I'm saying? Sometimes I wish it was a world where, where it wasn't no social media, you know what I'm saying? Because they got a lot of people's minds fucked up. It, it, it changed a lot of people. It's a lot of, you know what I'm saying? It's a lot of actors, if you get what I'm saying. It's a, it's a lot of actors in this shit, you know what I'm saying? But, yeah, that's all, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, bro, be you. Ain't nothing wrong with being you, bro. I be myself all the time, bro. And don't get peer pressure, bro. I promise you. Peer pressure is a motherfucker, bro. Don't do it. And if people talking, you doing something right. Yeah, bro, you doing something right, bro. You gonna always have some haters. I got... Yo, bro. Ain't even gonna know. A nigga you ride with the whole time. Whole time he hating on some shit. Real talk, though. Real talk. But yeah, you feel me? 
just be yourself. I'm gonna always push you to be yourself because I'm gonna be myself. You feel me? So, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I love to teach. You know what I'm saying? I love to teach, but I love to give a lesson out. And I, I feel like I push that through my music. You know what I'm saying? That's why I be speaking that real shit. You feel me? But yeah, reporting live from, you know what I'm saying? Echo Heights on the east side. You feel me? Fort Worth. You know what I'm saying? Born and raised. Yeah, shout out to Tyler Texas, my second home. You feel me? Yeah. Yeah. Must do. That fast life. That fast life for real. You know what I'm saying? We gonna be down there soon, oh God. Yeah, we finna be live. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And on the fourth, niggas finna turn up. Oh my, oh my mama, must do. You know what I'm saying? 10K shit for real. 10K the best way. You know what I'm saying? But yeah. All right, we are signing out. You know what I'm saying? 10K, you know what I'm saying? Shouts out to everybody that came. You know what I'm saying? It's your boy Gated Jewel signing out.